Google Sheets, working with multiple sheets. A Google Spreadsheet can contain one or more sheets. When working with a large amount of information, you can create multiple sheets to help organize your spreadsheet and make it easier to find information. In this lesson, you'll learn how to create, rename, move, delete, and duplicate sheets. There is a presentation that you should see on your side here. After you have watched that video and looked through those slides, please make sure that you follow on down to the What You Will Do section. In this section, it gives you all of the steps that you need to complete in order to submit this assignment. You can make a copy of the file by clicking here. You can open it there so you can make a copy. Or you can hit File and make a copy on the document that will be listed here on your side. I've already got mine open, so I'm going to navigate back over to my sheet so you can see my open sheet. And I've already made a copy of this sheet. Let's go to Canvas to see what our next step is in our directions. Step 2 says delete the sheet titled Sheet 1. So let's go back over to Sheets. I find on the bottom bar, January, Sheet 1, February, March, and April, I need to delete Sheet 1. So I'm going to right click on it, or if you're on a Chromebook, you would need to tap with two fingers, go to the top, and click Delete. Heads up, are you sure you want to delete this sheet? I do, so I'm going to click OK. Now I'll go back over to Canvas. Step 3 says duplicate the January sheet and rename it May. So I'm going to go back into my sheet. I want to duplicate my January sheet. So with two fingers, if you're on a Chromebook, or right click if you are on a PC, go to Duplicate, and you'll see that now I have January and Copy of January. I want to rename my Copy of January, so I'm going to right click or tap with two fingers and go up to Rename. The one I'm supposed to name this to is May. So now I will just click off of there. And now I have a January, May, February, March, and April. Let's go back over to Canvas. The next step says move the sheet you just renamed to the right of the April sheet. So let's go back over to our sheets. Find the May sheet we just created. I'm going to click and hold the May sheet, and then I'll use my cursor and move my cursor to the end of that list. You'll see that your mouse turns to a four-way triangle while doing this. Excuse me, your cursor turns to a four-way triangle. Let's go all the way to the end, and we'll drop it just to the right of April. Release your click. All right, let's go back over to Sheets and Canvas, excuse me, our Canvas assignment. And number five says create a new sheet and rename it June. Let's navigate back over to our Sheets. In order to create a new sheet, all I need to do is click on this plus as I hover over it, it says Add Sheet. So I'm going to click on my plus. And you'll see that I have January, February, March, April, May, and my Sheet 2 appears on the far right of this list. I needed to rename it, so I'm going to right-click or with two fingers tap if you're on a Chromebook. And I'm going to rename June. Click off of it. Let's navigate back over to Canvas. And it says number six, open the May sheet. 
So I'm going to go back into my sheet. And it says open the May sheet. So I'm going to click on May. Now the last couple things that we need to do, we need to rename our file. Make sure that you are following the directions from your teacher. This is going to call, be called demo. And I'm going to move this file to my DAR folder. Click move. And the last thing that we will need to do is um, click on share. And I need to change the link to MSD Warren Township. And I'll copy this link. Click done. And then I can go back over to Canvas and scroll to the top of my assignment. Click Submit Assignment. And I can copy and paste this. It's already copied. I'll just paste it. Or I could also use the Control V shortcut and submit your assignment. And you are now finished.